Your teacher today is Dr. Bosa Science. Dr. Bosa is a teacher at the Science Foundation College, the best school that teaches sciences. Today, 22nd October 2020, we are going to revise objective questions in coordination. One, on the state of the polarization of an accusation occurs when axoplasm temporarily become A, more negative, B, less negative, C, more positive, D, less positive. The answer is C, when it becomes more positive. Once the depolarization occur, when sodium ion is diffused into the axoplasm and it becomes more positive. Two, wearing a coarse shirt causes tinkling sensation, but the sensation disappears. Which one of the following is not an explanation of this observation? A, supply of transmitter substance get exhausted. B, the discharge of impulse at a fallent nerve ceases. C, the membrane surrounding the generator region become less permeable to sodium ions. D, the interpotential falls below threshold. You can pause. Answer, then we continue. The answer is B. The discharge of impulses continues, but either A, the supply of transmitter substance, get exhausted at the synapse, or the membrane surrounding the generator region become less permeable to sodium ion, or the generator potential falls below threshold value. Which of the following occurs when the axon depolarizes? A. Sodium enters, potassium leaves the axon. B. Both sodium and potassium ions leave the axon. C. Potassium enters the axon, sodium leaves. D. Both Sodium and potassium leave. You can pause and answer. The answer is A. When the action depolarizes, sodium enters, while potassium leaves the action. For a person who works unsteadily, may have a defect in the A, cerebrum, B, cerebrum, C, medulla oblongata, D, hypothalamus. You can pause and answer. The answer is B. Number five, which one of the following describes the sodium potassium pump? A, Active pumping of potassium ions out of the axon and sodium ions into it. B. Equal concentration of the ions on either side of the axon at rest. B. Inability of the axon to absorb the two ions passively. B. Active pumping of sodium ions out of the axon and potassium ions into it. You can pause and answer. The answer is D. The sodium potassium pump pumps two ions of sodium out of the axon against one ion of potassium into the axon. Six, 
which one of the following is not a transmitter substance? A. Astrocholine. B. Choline stress. C. Atropine. D. Noradrenaline. You can you pause? Answer. Then we continue. The answer is B. Choline stress is an enzyme which destroys astrocholine at the synapse. Number seven, the principal function of autonomic nervous system is to A. Innervate internal organs. B. Control contraction of skeletal muscles. C. Regulate and control peripheral nervous system. D. Transmit impulses from the brain to the peripheral nervous system. You can pause and answer. Then we continue. The answer is A. Innovate internal organs. Those organs which are not under the conscious control of the brain. Number eight, which of the following represents the correct order of events that occurs at the synapse during impulse transmission? A. Calcium and influx, release of transmitter substances, depolarization. B. Depolarization, release of transmitter substances, calcium influx. C. Release of transmitter substances, calcium influx, depolarization. D. Release of transmitter substances, depolarization, calcium ion influx. You can pause and answer, then we continue. The answer is A. Arrival of impulse. At the synaptic knob causes influx of calcium ions into the knob. Calcium ions attracts synaptic vesicles to the presynaptic membrane to release the transmitter substances. The transmitter substances cross the synaptic cleft causing the polarization on post-synaptic membrane. Number nine, a likely effect of inhibiting the action of astrocholine at the synapse is A, cessation of impulse transmission, B, continuous impulse transmission, C, Speeding of impulse transmission, D. Slowing down of impulse transmission. You can pause and answer, then we continue. The answer is A. Cessation of impulse transmission. Number 10. Which one of the following occurs to the archison membrane during the action? Potential. It is A. Polarized inside negative, outside positive. B. Depolarized with inside negative, outside positive. C. Depolarized with inside positive, outside negative. D. Polarized with inside positive. Outside negative. You can pause and then we continue. The answer is C. It is depolarized inside the positive, outside negative. In the resting membrane potential, the membrane is polarized outside the positive and inside negative. So the polarization is the reversal of the resting membrane potential. So it is depolarized inside the positive and outside negative. Number 11, myelinated 
axons of a frog conduct impulses three times less fast than those of the same diameter in a rat because the a marinated surface in the axon of a frog are thinner b rats are endothermic c Neurons of a frog have more synapses. D. Frog lives in water that is cold. You can pause, answer, and then we continue. The answer is B. The rat is endothermic, maintains a higher temperature, and the higher the temperature, the faster the transmission of impulses. Number 12, increase permeability of post-synaptic membrane to allow chloride the iron in and the potassium iron out of the cell causes A, the polarization of the cell membrane, B, polarization of the cell membrane, C, Excitation of the cell membrane, D. Hyperpolarization of the cell membrane. So you can pause and answer. Then we continue. The answer is D. Hyperpolarization of the cell membrane. Number 13. After the action potential, the polarization of the membrane begins by A, entry of sodium into the cell, B, sodium ion is diffusing out of the cell, C, entry of potassium ion is into the cell, D, potassium ion is diffusing out of the cell. You can pause, answer. And then we continue. The answer is D. The polarization begins with the potassium ions diffusing out of the cell. Number 14. Wearing a coarse shirt causes unpleasant sensation at first, but later the discomfort disappears because. A. With the continued stimulus, generator potential follows below threshold body. B. Post synaptic surface fails to release transmitter substances. C. Nervous system stops to carry impulse. D. Continued stimulation. Leads to fusion of generator potential. You can pause and answer. Then the answer is A. Then the answer is A. With the continued stimulus, generator potential falls below threshold value. Number 15. Which of the following is the correct statement about the neuron? During resting potential. A. Inside the neural membrane is negatively charged. B. The potassium, sodium, cloud ions are evenly distributed on either side of the membrane. C. The concentration of sodium is greater inside. D. The concentration of potassium is greater. Outside, you can pause and answer. The answer is A. Inside of the neuron membrane is negatively charged. Outside the membrane, there is a high concentration of sodium. Inside the membrane, there is a high concentration of potassium ions. So the membrane is described as being polarized, positively charged outside, negatively charged 
inside. Number 16, which of the following describes the state of the membrane during resting potential? A. Paralyzed. B. Neutral. C. Depolarized. D. Discharged. You can pause and answer and then we continue. The answer is A. It is polarized. It maintains a potential between outside and inside. Outside being relatively positive compared to the inside. Number 17. Which of the following is correct about sympathetic nervous system? A. Nerve endings produce noradrenaline. <coughs> B. Preganglionic fibers are long. Postganglionic fibers are short. C. Nerve endings produce acetylcholine. D. Ganglia are embedded in the walls of the effector. You can pause and answer. The answer is A. Nerve endings produce noradrenaline. Number 18. The figure below shows changes in electrical potentials in an axon membrane when the impulse is transmitted. At which stage of electrical potential marked is the axon most permeable to sodium ion? You can pause and answer. The answer is A. Number 19, impulses close the synapse by means of A, sodium ions, B, potassium ions, C, transmitter substances, D, calcium ions. You can pause, answer, then we continue. The answer is C, by transmitter substances. That is acetylcholine or noradrenaline in the sympathetic nervous system. Number 20, impulse transmission in the mammals is usually faster than it is in amphibians because A, axonies of amphibians lack myelinic self, B, Mammals have axons with larger diameters. C. Mammals usually have high body temperatures. D. The distances between the nodes of lavia in mammals is short. You can pause and answer. The answer is C. Mammals usually have higher body temperatures. The higher the body temperature, the faster the impulse transmission. Number 21, which of the following would occur at the onset of action potential in a neuron? A, potassium ions enter. B, Sodium ions leave. C. Potassium ions leave. D. Sodium ions enter. You can pause and answer. Then we continue. The answer is D. Sodium ions enter. In resting membrane potential, there are more sodium ions outside the membrane than inside the membrane. On the onset of action potential, sodium ions enter the neuron. Number 22, which one of the following is caused by high concentration of sodium ions outside a neuron? A, production of successive action potential B, 
excitation of a neuron, C, inhibition of release of transmitter substances, D, polarization of the neuron. Can you pause and answer? Then we continue. The answer is D. When the neuron is paralyzed, outside there's more sodium, inside there's more potassium ion is. Number 23, which one of the following does not happen when an impulse reaches a synapse? A, facilitating passage of subsequent impulses. B, being blocked. C, being reversed. D, inhibiting passage of subsequent impulse. You can pause and answer. Then we continue. The answer is A. When an impulse passes through a, a synapse, there is a refractory period through which another impulse cannot pass. 24. During an action potential in a neuron, A, potassium diffuses into the axon B, Sodium diffuses out of the axon. C. Sodium diffuses into the axon. D. Both sodium and potassium ions diffuse out. Can you pose an answer? The answer is C. Number 25. Injection of cyrocosine into a laboratory mammal would cause A, oxygen consumption to increase, B, metabolic rate to increase, C, conversion of glucose to glycogen, D, thyroid gland to become more active. You can you pause and answer? The answer is A, 26, a mother who lacked milk, in her breast, at the birth of her baby, was diagnosed to have a brain damage. Which of the following parts of the brain is likely to be affected? A. Posterior lobe of pituitary gland. B. Pineal body. C. Anterior lobe of pituitary gland. D. Cerebellum. Can you pause and answer? The answer is C, posterior lobe of pituitary gland, which produces prolactin, a hormone that induces production of breast milk. Number 27, many chef and diameter of the axon of a neuron are important in that they A, enable impulses to be transmitted from one node of Lanvia to another, B, increase the speed at which impulses are transmitted, C, maintain constant strength of each impulse, D, allow quick exchange of ions. You can pose an answer. The answer is B, the speed of an impulse depends on the diameter of an axon. The bigger the diameter, the faster the speed of the impulse. Marinated axons transport impulses faster than non marinated axons. Three, temperature. The higher the temperature, the faster the speed of an impulse. 28. Which of the following is correct about the refractory period in an axon of a nerve fiber? A. Inhibitory post-synaptic potential are generated. B. Voltage activated sodium channel open. C. Axon cannot transmit. 
cannot transmit impulse. D. Axon can transmit impulses at higher voltage. So both C and D are correct. At relative refractory period, Axon can transmit impulse at higher voltage. At absolute refractory period, an axon cannot transmit impulses. 29. Which of the following would be the best indicator that a cell is responding to a hormone? A. High concentration of cyclic AMP. B. Low concentration of cyclic AMP. C. Low concentration of adenylate cyclase. D. High amount of ATP in the cell. You can pause and answer. The answer is A. Cells that are responding to hormone have got high concentration of cyclic AMP. Thank you very much for listening to this video. You can get more videos from our YouTube channel, Digital Teachers Uganda. Or you can get other resources in a barrage and the other subjects on the website digitalteachers.co.ug I'm requesting you to subscribe to promote my videos. Remember that subscription for these videos is entirely free. Just click the subscription button, fill in your email and it will be done.